Howdy to you ladies, my name is Jacksepticon, welcome to True or False, it's a new game that came out on Steam where you just get in, it asks you a piece of trivia, and you say if it's true or false, and I like these types of games, it's a very would you rather, kind of higher or lower type of thing, very simple, but uh, we're gonna see if I can answer any of these correctly, um, it is free to play, you can get in and do the free to play version, I did get an expansion little thing that allowed for like 500 more questions, just so we have more variety and there's more stuff to ask, and stuff doesn't loop or repeat because I did see some of the reviews talking about that so do it okay I just have that installed but I like the music that's great uh, menu music okay campaign it's a good look booper duper nearly 37% of purchase steam games are never played oh, okay what a great way to start off because how many people purchase this game actually it's free to play you don't purchase it uh, um true I'd imagine because with all the steam sales that go on people just buy games like hmm that's on sale, I'll buy that and play it later. Uh, I just got it, I got it cheap. And then they never play it, so, true. Correct! That's true! Yes! Thank you! Off to a great start. Albert Einstein was an avid bodybuilder. No. Correct! That's false! He wasn't an avid bodybuilder. You'd think you'd see more pictures of him. Swole! Swalbert Einstein! Albert Swolstein. <laughs> You'd see way more pictures of him showing off his muscles then. No, he was an avid mustache grower. There's a chocolate scented flower. True. Yeah, I got an achievement called Chocolate Fan. <laughs> Olympic gold medals are only 1% gold and 92.5% silver. Ooh. No, I, I think they might be higher than 1%. I wouldn't be surprised if this was true. They just have like a coating of gold over them. But the rest of them is actually silver. I'm gonna say false. Wrong! It was true! I should have gone with my instincts! Okay, goldfish are neither gold nor fish. False. Wait! False? Yeah, that's false! They are fish! What else would they be? Fucking submarines? A single asteroid can contain 20 trillion dollars worth of metals. Yeah, because aren't they- uh, some of them are like pure metals. Some of them are like- oh wait, asteroids. Yeah, asteroids, not comets. Comets are like dust and ice. But asteroids are like dense and full of shit. True. Correct. That's true. That's a lot of metals in one asteroid. An asteroid the size of your fist. That's why they sell for so much. When something lands, like you have space metals and space material. And you can sell them for really, really high prices. A potato isn't a vegetable, it's a large bean. Like me? I'm a potato and I'm a large- actually no. I'm small bean. Um, false. Correct, that's false. It's not a large bean. I'm Irish. I know what potatoes are what. I know what they do. If I got that wrong, God, for shame on my family and my heritage. Um, even though I don't eat potatoes all that much. Shocking, I know, it's because it's cannibalistic. King Henry VIII slept with a gigantic axe. I don't know, did he call his wife his axe? <laughs> Isn't Henry VIII the one with all the wives? True! Why the fuck not? Wrong, that's false. Damn it! Henry VIII, I thought you were cool going to bed with a giant axe under your fuck- Maybe he slept on a bed in the shape of a giant axe. That would be awesome. The vanilla flower blooms during only one day. False. Wrong, that's true. It only blooms during one day? How the hell do people get anything out of it? Medical errors cause over 250,000 American deaths each year. Each year, not each year. What am I talking about? I was looking at the cat's ears. <laughs> um, true. A little bit. That's a satisfying sound. A satisfying little jingle. The Tetris theme is actually a Russian folk song called Kurbiniki. What? Should we search that? It is! It is true! God, God, Tetris, you stealing motherfuckers! But then again, there is one. What was the one that I remember seeing? Oh, phone is buzzing, shut up. There was one that I remember seeing, it was like the Metal Gear Solid theme was something else. Go search up that one, that one's really cool and it's kind of hard not to see that it's very very similar. And there's a video of somebody handing it to Hideo Kojima and he listens to it and he's like, 
Oh, like he had no idea that that was going on. Agatha Christie was a surfer. False. Agatha Christie! You badass! Surfing those waves like that. Barack Obama was born in Kenya. Oh, I don't know this. Because isn't there a big thing going on like, oh, show us your birth certificate. And then Futurama did a parody of it. But it was saying like he wasn't American because he was born somewhere else. So true? Wrong, that's false. Damn it! I don't know! I don't know stuff about Obama! I just know that he has family in Ireland, in Offaly, and he came here a few years ago. That's all I know, and then his car got stuck in the, <laughs> the thing going out of the, the Dublin office. Oh, so funny! <laughs> Koala bears have fingerprints that are identical to human fingerprints. Crime scene experts can even mistake one for the other. That can't be true! I know koala bears have cool fingers and everything. That can't be true. What?! <laughs> Scientists confuse koala bear fingerprints for human ones at crime scenes. It's like, could have been, uh, could have been old George uh, Costanza there who, uh, did that crime. Yeah. Or it could have been, uh, uh, Fluffy from the zoo. <laughs> That's awesome! I'm learning so much! I'm getting a lot of them wrong recently, though. Can I? No! Oh, it picks up where I was last time. I clicked this because I thought it would show me statistics or something. Shit. Other than man, the elk is the only animal that celebrates birthdays. Elk celebrate the false. Correct, that's false. Elk. Are you positing that elk celebrate their own birthdays? Like, hey, Aunt Lee. Yeah, oh, it's your birthday today. Surprise. Kind of thing. Because I'd imagine dolphins do that as well and monkeys because they're fucking smarter than elk. In 1998, Sony released a camcorder that could see through clothes. False. What? How can you see through clothes with a camcorder? Isn't that X- Well, it's not x-ray vision, because you'd have to see through flesh to see bones for that. But, what? what? I never heard that before. That's nuts. What's it called? The Great Pyramid of Giza has four sides. Oh. Uh, are you- <laughs> A pyramid has four sides, but are you counting the bottom one as a side? Because then that's false. I'm gonna say false because I think it's a trick question. Correct, that's false. I wish I told you the actual answer then. Like, yes, that's false. It actually has 49 sides. If you count, actually it has a hundred, a thousand and four sides if you count all the, the blocks that went into it. Um, a 46 year old man from England found and at attacked a 13 year old kid for killing him in Call of Duty too many times. Oh. That's, that's, that's detailed and, and pathetic and sad enough to actually be true. A 46 year old man killed a 13 year old because of Call of Duty. What is humanity? Why? I remember. A while ago as well, Manhunt got a lot of shit as well, because a kid killed his friend kind of like how you would in Manhunt, and people were saying it's because he had the game and he wanted it and all this type of stuff, so they were saying blame video games for this stuff. I mean, <laughs> a video game was to blame for that, but it didn't make him a murderer because of it. Put it that way. The game, he reacted to something in the game that made him go kill the kid, which is fucking Barbaric and moronic and we could talk about that all day, but a lot of people would say yep video games cause murderers But that's not the case. He likely had that fucking murderous intent in him already a video game isn't suddenly gonna make you want to kill people There is a tree that can grow 40 different kinds of fruit. I hope this is true Whoa What tree is it? I want to eat the fruit off that tree Paul McCartney composed the entire melody of the song yesterday in a dream one night um, I also hope this is true. This is me not knowing now and it's hoping that this is true, so I want to say it's true. Wow! Paul McCartney, you're a legend! What else? Warcraft only had three developers, two of whom had never previously worked on video games. F oh god. The original Warcraft, that's ages ago by now, so... True? Again, some of these are pretty detailed. It's like, badgers can't see at night. It's kind of like, well, that's a very short description, but this seems very detailed to not be true. <laughs> you hear that sound? That's the sound of my failure. <laughs> that's what it sounds like when I fail at life. <laughs> I sound like Pac-Man dying. 
Okay, let's go a few more. One of the cosmonauts claimed that aliens came to Earth in order to stop a nuclear war against Russia. Please be false. Oh, why? <laughs> oh, I'm learning all these weird shits about humanity right now. Oh, God. What happened to him up in space? <laughs> Halo 3 inspired Bill Gates to invent the internet. No, Tim Berners-Lee invented the internet. And Halo 3 came around when the internet was already there. The internet was invented in like... 1990-something. I can't remember the year. 96? 95? 90? No, not 90. Can't remember. But no, Tim Berners-Lee invented it, not Bill Gates. Bill Gates invented fucking Windows. And he's Microsoft and all that shit. Oh! There's a potato theme park in Ireland! True! <laughs> it's called Tato Park! Because <laughs> Tato are like the potato chips or crisps, as we call them. We don't call them potato chips, we call them crisps. Okay? And biscuits are not fluffy things that you break apart and dip in gravy. Biscuits are like a wide variety of things. Like the bottom of a cheesecake. Or cookies are biscuits. They're just a different type of- You call cookies- Okay, let's not get into it. It's not Jack versus America right now. <laughs> but I have said some of these, like, phrases before and then everyone's like, what? Why would you say it like that? So, there's always a debate in the comments of how I say things. Uh, okay, last one! 61% of cats prefer opera over Korean pop music. K-pop is quite addictive, though. I don't know. True. I do know that cows sometimes respond well to symphonic music. Um... True. Wrong. Cats prefer K-pop! You heard it here first, folks! <laughs> so what should call the episodes. Cats prefer K-pop. I like the sound of that. Anyway, I'm gonna leave this episode of True or False here a fun little game. I'm glad I did get the expansion because, again, I did see some of the Steam reviews say that after like 10 questions, they were getting repeat questions, which kind of sucks. So I'm glad I got like the, the 500 extra ones because that probably would have got very repetitive very quickly otherwise. But again, I like these simple types of games because you do learn stuff every now and then, like learning that it's some... Learning that a, a 46-year-old killed a 13-year-old over Call of Duty. Learning that a cosmonaut thought that aliens came to stop nuclear war. Kind of shit, so it's interesting. It's factual. Did you learn something today? Tell me something that you didn't know in this or you probably didn't know several of them or stuff that you did know that came up. I don't know. Tell if there's anything that you learned from it. I I'm curious because I learned some stuff from it. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this episode. If you liked it, punch that like button in the face like a boss and hi guys all. Thank you guys for everyone. See all you dudes. I am the best! Oh shit. Might not be the best anymore! Make it! Make it! Yeah, buddy! <laughs> I'm curious if you could see that in the video. When I, like, I leaned over and a big drool of spit landed on the table. And I wiped it away in the middle of the outro. So, <laughs> oh, that's gross. <laughs>